And now, for Tasty Tasty with Chef Potato. Hello kids, I'm your host Chef Potato, and today we're going to be cooking up a scrum umptious dish known as a tuna potato. <laughs> First, head on down to the beach and catch yourself a tuna. Somehow in RuneScape we can manage to catch deep sea fish right offshore like it ain't no thing. Who woulda thunk it? Then you gotta go into your parent's sock drawer and take the lube out. We're gonna use that as butter. Go on down to your neighborhood cornfield and steal some corn. And most importantly, you need a potato. So go get one. I think they're on sale at Publix right now. Ugh, who am I kidding? How many of you actually have a Publix as your grocery store? You should probably leave a comment down below. You know, because you don't know where it's located, remember? Yeah, leave a comment and tell me where you get your groceries. Because I'm a creep and I want to know these things. Now that we got our supplies, we need to put them all together in a tasty mash of tuna potatoes. First head over to the nearest cooking range and cook up your tuna, your corn, and your potato. Be careful not to eat your ingredients here. Although they may look tasty, they actually taste like crap until they do the fusion dance and become a single entity of delicious proportions. After you get all that cooking XP, we need to smother that potato with butter. Then, chop the tuna up into chunks because it would be stupid to put an entire tuna on a potato, right? After chopping the tuna up into a bowl, add the corn to the bowl to get a bowl of cereal. Oh, oh, that's a typo. Yeah, add, the, add it to get a bowl of tuna corn, that's what I wanted to say. <laughs> now all that's left is to find the tesseract in order to harness enough energy to combine the two. Once you locate the tesseract and harness said energy, combine both, and voila, you have a tuna potato. I'll see you next time, where we'll probably cook something that's ten times better than a tuna potato. Have a great day, and stay tasty.